Hi everyone, the other day Game of Thrones Season 6 was released on DVD in the Blu-ray format. Moreover, HBO Channel presented short but very interesting fragment which unfortunately was deleted from Season 6. Thus, in this scene the Queen of Thorns talks to her son Mace Tyrell, Lord of Highgarden. She tells her son off toughly and directly because of his foresight and naivety. Olenet tells Mace that Cersei sent him to Bravos not to have negotiations with the Iron Bank, but to put his out of her way. Once again this scene reminds us of that ridiculous moment when Mace Tyrell was negotiating on behalf of the Iron Throne in Bravos, and how silly he looked. The son and his mother are so much different from each other, Mace has hardly a tenth part of wisdom, shrewdness and stamina, the qualities possessed by the Queen of Thorns. However she continues talking to her son that he not only walked himself off Cersei's way, but also idols away his time, eating drinking and singing songs. Her last remark, again alludes to the negotiations with the Iron Bank. Their further conversation clearly showed us that Mace is not so much interested in his children's fates, but his position as the master of coin, while from the Olena's words it is clear that her main aim is to rescue her grandson and granddaughter from a bloody prison. Her speech ends with the following words. And we will leave this miserable place, and let the sparrows and lannisters rip each other to pieces. This scene was supposed to be released in the second episode of season 6, but for some reason the serial makers have decided to cut it off. Of course, now we already know that plans of the Queen of Thorns were destined to fail, just as it was destined to save neither of her son nor her grandchildren. Well, I think that this published fragment once again represents that Olena Tyrell will play not the last role in the events of Season 7, this woman has already demonstrated what she is capable of having poisoned the King Joffrey. Now, when all her heirs are dead, she has nothing at all to be afraid of and as she said in the conversation with Ilaria, revenge was her main aim. So, Cersei acquired very strong and dangerous enemy in the person of the Queen of Thorns, and so it will be more interesting for us to watch their confrontation in Season 7. As to this short unrealized fragment, HBO probably tries to satisfy somehow the interest of serial fans during the break between seasons. Well, this is all for today, so thanks for your watching, please share this video write your comments and subscribe to our channel. Also you could watch other videos about the Game of Thrones right now. Have a great day and goodbye everyone.